So I did 7 by 7 by 7, which is 21 by 21 by 21 for each house. And then I went up by about 10 centimeters for the house wall. And then I just did this all in pencil and measured it up to make three different houses with three rooms. And I've used a vivid marker and a ruler and now I'm just going to go over the pencil lines with vivid marker. So they are the rooms, that's the ones, the tens, and the hundreds, we're going into the thousands, and now we're going into the millions house. So now I'm about to do the roof of each of the houses. Pretty easy, just put it on the slab, the house, and then just put the roof on top. And there we have our wonderful houses, fantastic. So ones, thousands, and millions. And I've written them on, so I've got ones, tens, and hundreds, and I've got the ones actual house there, and I've got the the thousands, tens of thousands, hundreds of thousands, and the thousands house, and and again, I shall go back. And so this is the finished product. I've got millions, thousands, and ones, and now I'm just cutting around the chart just to make it look better. And voila, there it is. And so here I've got the white card and I'm writing numbers 1 to 9. I shouldn't have put 10 there because I don't need to put 10. And then I've just done it twice. And then I'm going to sellotape them up or tape them up so that they're more robust when I use them with kids. And I'm going to do the back as well. Yeah, that's butter. And so next, I'm gonna get my trusty scissors and choppity chop the numbers up. Just like that, chop chop. And so here's our chart and I'm going to put a couple of numbers on just to see what they look like, but I need to sellotape the back or tape them. So I rolled up some tape and put them on the back of the number. And then I've just placed it, whoops, wrong. I kind of want to start at the ones house first, so that's 100. And I've got a nine there, so I'll do the same with that. And, and I've got 194 in the ones house. So I've got one lot of hundred, I've got nine tens, and I've got four ones. That makes 194. And next I'm going into the thousands. And as you can see, there's my chart, and I've got numbers on most of the houses. Here's the one. Okay, guys, so here you have it, the millions, thousands of one house with all of the place values there and some example numbers. So I've got the ones, the thousands, and the millions. And this is what it looks like close up. It's going to look good on the classroom wall and as a teaching device. You can also make this at home for your own kids. Cheers for watching, guys. Rate and subscribe.